Junior League of Dallas has been working over the last two years to support the restoration of the Juanita J. Craft Civil Rights House and Museum. Many of you may not know about Juanita Craft, and that frankly is the important reason why we wanted to make this our centennial project. Juanita Craft devoted her life believing that all Americans should have equal rights and with a commitment to civil rights in our society. From 1950 until her death in 1985, Juanita Craft's home in South Dallas near Fair Park served as command central for some of the most pivotal moments in civil rights here in Dallas and beyond. During this time, she established a vast network across Texas to promote equal rights for all Americans, organizing 182 branches of the NAACP and championing integration of the Texas State Fair in 1961. Working through the NAACP's Texas State Conference of Branches, Mrs. Kraft fought for the rights of African Americans to serve on a jury, vote in the Democratic primaries, and receive an education from professional and collegiate schools. She served on the board of the Urban League of Greater Dallas. She was the first African-American woman in Dallas County to vote and the first African-American woman to serve on the Dallas City Council. Over the years, Mrs. Kraft's home served as a central hub. It was a place to really get engaged in community discussions. Her home was a meeting space for NAACP Youth Council, voter registration drives, many of the Women's Voter League meetings, and was the headquarters for her two successful Dallas City Council races. During the Jim Crow era, Mrs. Kraft would host musical guests like Louis Armstrong, Marian Anderson, and Duke Ellington, because many hotels were prohibited for African Americans. Upon her death in 1985, she willed her home to the city of Dallas to be used to advance her mission to improve civil and human rights through education, advocacy, government, and civil discourse. The city of Dallas is grateful and thrilled that the Junior League of Dallas picked the Juanita Craft Civil Rights House and Museum as the beneficiary of their centennial celebration. Ms. Craft, a civic leader who made a tremendous impact both in her community in South Dallas and across our city, our state, and even our nation, willed her house to the city of Dallas in the hope that it would be a place to inspire the next generation to make a positive impact in their community. It was her strong belief in the ability of individuals to make a difference. The Junior League is working along with us to inspire future visitors to this home so that they will fully recognize the values of service and dedicated hard work and compassion to make a difference in our community here and beyond.